everyone, it's Christina here. Welcome back to my kitchen. This is the place where we learn how to bake and cook together every week. Uh, this week, I'm going to show you how to make a baked cheesecake with pineapple curd. It was for a collaboration for Instagram and it was my first time making a baked cheesecake. Um, I prefer the classic one though now, uh, but it was really, really good. And I do hope you enjoy it and I do hope you're gonna get try and make it. And if you do, don't forget to tag me because I would love to see your creations. Uh, of course, there are pictures on my Instagram account, which is at Christina's Cuisine. And on YouTube, the video will be on Rapid. But if you do like what you see here today and you're not one of my subscribers yet, don't forget to subscribe because it means so so much to me and that, tap that little bell because now you get notifications every time we put a video up i want to thank you so much for watching i hope you're staying safe and taking care of yourselves until next time go back and make guys for the crust of the cheesecake 300 grams of biscuits i'm using a biscoff now for every cheesecake i make because they uh they taste really really good um, and 100 milliliters um, grams of butter which is going to be melted and also I'm going to add uh, one tablespoon um, of brown sugar so we're going to crumble the biscuits melt the butter and make a crust All right so um, mix the butter and biscuits the sugar and put them in your uh, baking tray mine's are um, loose bottom trays so i'm going to use two a small one and a big one um, and we're going to bake the crust for about seven minutes at 180 degrees and we're going to start on the filling in the meantime so the filling beats 600 grams of cream cheese, soft cheese, 200 uh, milliliters sour cream, 240 grams of granulated sugar, three eggs, uh, we're gonna add a tablespoon of vanilla and a pinch of salt, and also the zest of a lemon. So we start by mixing sugar and cream cheese, cream cheese first. to bake it for about 50 minutes at 180 so and you know it's going to be baked when there will be no wobble yeah so this wobble it's not gonna be there so well uh, I'll come back to you when it's coming out of the oven stay tuned I'm gonna make a pineapple glaze for it as well. Okay guys, so for the pineapple uh, juice, we're doing four, four tablespoons of, um, of sugar and two tablespoons of water. And you let them um, boil a bit, about two, three minutes on the fire. Take it off the fire. We're gonna add a pinch of salt. And we're going to add our pineapple. I'm going to squeeze. 
squeeze it because it doesn't need all the juice. So it will be crushed and squeezed pineapple in here. I'm using the whole pineapple. Okay. You can save all this juice and um, use it for something else. So you can even like make a cocktail with something, with vodka or anything else. <laughs> So we're going to add one tablespoon of cornstarch dissolved in two tablespoons of water. Then we're going to boil this for a bit just until it thickens up. It needs to be like a like a thick paste. And then once the um, cheesecake have cooled down and the sauce needs to be cooled as well, you can take the cheesecake out of your tray. this loveliness on top and just serve it cold preferably overnight if you can leave it in the fridge overnight but yeah I'll um, show you when it's all ready for the fridge stay tuned so here we go guys all done and the puree on top oh my it smells absolutely gorgeous i can't wait to have a slice i hope you enjoyed take care of yourselves